I like sort of finding patterns and geometry in them, and I think that that really draws people in, draws me in. We have Google Maps, we have Google Earth that, that sort of serves that purpose if you just want to see what they look like. I want to present them with my own sort of take on it. Um, I want to show them in a, in a way that I think uh, makes them look beautiful or inspiring in some way. My name is Peter Andrew Lustig. For the last 10 years, I've been photographing highway interchanges. I've shot probably about 50 different highway interchanges around the world. You know, working in the studio, doing still life photography, you have a lot of control and you sort of start out with this image in your head of what you want something to look like and you construct it in a way where you can get closer and closer to that. And shooting aerial stuff where there's all these moving parts, all these different variables, you very often come home with something that you didn't anticipate and that's kind of part of the fun. In looking through the viewfinder of the camera, stuff sort of starts to slow down and as you're composing the image, all of a sudden, you're not really thinking about all the other wildness that's kind of going on, and you're just looking through at, 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 the, at the image sort of coming together and then, and then falling apart again. You're sort of trying to capture that perfect moment where everything comes together. and it, So everything kind of goes still for a sec, and then as, as soon as you look away from the camera, everything starts moving again. It, it's a really amazing feeling. The majesty of aerial photography still resonates with us because it's a, it's a way of seeing the world that didn't exist and really without technology doesn't exist.